These are dual instrument inner monitor cables. One is from TC Helicon and the other is like this one I've put together myself. It's a pretty simple DIY concept. It's an instrument cable and a mini stereo extension cable loomed together in braided expandable sleeving. There are very few of these that are available and the ones that are available from built to order companies are relatively expensive. The much cheaper TC Helicon is no longer available. This is an example of expandable sleeving that's available from Amazon. I'm not going to go into how to put them together in this video. That's something that really becomes self-explanatory if you decide to put them together yourself. The sleeve works with a finger cuff type action and you're able to feed pre-built or bare cable ends through. The expansion is something like 3 to 1 and that gives enough room to work with. As for the connections, I personally use a pedal board mounted headphone amp from Coda Music. Uh, the headphone plugs in on the front and the output or outputs from the mixer go to the back. I have it arranged this way because it works best for me. The headphone side of the dual cable goes into the headphone amp and the base cable goes into amp, preamp, DI, whichever you're using. At the other end of the dual cable you have the input for your in-air monitors and the cable connection for your base. Personally, I loop over the strap and that ends up creating a nice, neat, uh, tucked away place for the inner monitor input that ends up being right behind the strap end. And running the IAM cable to the strap end creates about the same result as if it were plugged into a belt pack. The cable runs along the strap line, which is about the same. And that's it. You're running effectively with a single cable. No meaningful difference if you're already running your base wired.